Hello everyone. Oh yeah, there is some extra. We may have defeated the final boss. We may have proven that bacon is ultimate but has to be balanced. But there is more. Yeah, DLC stories. And no joke, they're quite interesting. First we're going to start with Jetstream. And then Blade Wolf. That's kind of interesting. That's one of the great features about this game. DLC stories. And uh, let's see. Story mode checkpoint. <laughs> Who gives a damn? We're pretty much done, are we? And screw it. I'm putting this on normal. Um, the tutorial would explain a few things about Jetstream. 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 Wow. About Sam's controls. But I already know a good part of it. And he's not, he's not the same, but he has his unique touches. Mmm, cherry blossoms. Yeah. I take it you're not a fan? No. They make me sick. I knew Johnson's team was working on some fancy pants new reception area. But Jesus. When I get my hands on that candy ass. He'll be lucky if he can even carry his box of shit out of the building. <laughs> Is it really so horrible? They're only trees. They go from full blossom to bare in a week. One fucking week. Everywhere in D.C. you hear, oh, it's so fleeting and beautiful. Pathetic. What do you think? Oh. Nature is just nature. Not beautiful, not ugly. The wind blows, the flowers float away. It's simply how things are. Huh. In any case, Minuano should be close. Minuano, the cool Brazilian wind. Mm. AKA Jetstream Sam. What the hell you think you're doing, buddy? Well, what do we have here? Oh. This? Amount of fucks given? Absolutely none. That's the cool part about Sam. Okay, so basically, you have the final blade from the beginning. Um, you can dash, of course. Uh, you can dash slash, which is quite cool. Um, stiff breeze. At the same time, you have power moves, so you can combo, combo into power moves. Uh, you can even do some kind of a cool air combo, a practically air cycle crusher, 
which is really fun. Um, what else? What else? What else? Right, his dodge is a bit. Um, his dodge is a bit wonky. It's not a dodge slash. It's basically straight up a dodge. So Sam can actually dodge. So he's got some different sets of moves. It's quite interesting. And uh, another thing about his gameplay is he doesn't acquire powers or acquire energy the same way Raiden does. Love that Psycho Crusher. I don't think he can air. No, he doesn't aerial juggle like Raiden. So he basically has this one move um, and this power down move. What else? I'm trying to remember some of his moves. Actually, the best way to figure out some of his moves is actually going here. So he does have the tree, you know, triple square combo, your charge triangle, which is quite cool. Uh, and at the same time, don't forget, you can do hit, hit, hold. So you get extra move <laughs> due to this holding mechanic or this charge up mechanic, which, you know, can get quite interesting. Um, let's see, this one I didn't remember. Completely didn't remember the drawbreaker. is mostly because as soon as you jump into that DLC, you're jumping in with uh, somewhat of a new character. If you, you know, if you want to call it like that. Uh, let's say a mid dash. You have extra attack during your mid dash. And you can taunt. Because you're that much of a douche. So, that's the thing. I still need to remember this. That. I, I haven't used enough of that. Actually, I haven't used any of it. Um, the kick to raise. That's quite good. Anyway, let's go. See, you can already bring bring people to their knees with that. Well, take their fluid at the same time. So Sam's gameplay is a bit more uh, power type. He also, you know, has his uh, counters, of course. And so far, I don't have that many recovery items. And messed up my blade mode. I was trying to take out that guard, but... Take out that guard robot, I mean. Ah, oh, screw it. This guy has a rocket launcher. He threatens me. Only one way to take that kind of person out. I haven't been spotted. And I can taunt. Look, guys, they can't even find me. Ah, <laughs> uh, would have been great. I'm wondering if he's gonna jump up there. Oh, wow. Okay, so my taunting alerted this guy. Wow, that sliced him to pieces. Is there a guy upstairs? I uh, might as well take care of that robot as he's coming in, right? Psycho Crusher! That is sweet! That's right, take the fluid! Chica chica! <laughs> has so much style, I love this shit! You can even do a bit of a peekaboo hit. See? It's just all about raw power. It is lovely. And right now, I can just mess him up from midair. Take the fluid and take it with style. Shit stream style, of course.
Rising Blade. Ah, oh, delicious. See, Sam is quite enjoyable once you understand and master some of his moves. Uh, his only issue is basically defensive. His parry is not as uh, top tier as Raiden's, from what I've seen, or from what I've experienced. And at the same time, I I forgot he had a double jump as well. Uh, another quirky mechanic with that character is the fact that if you want to get extra health, you are going to have to either get lucky with uh, the boxes, finding those boxes, and um, it's that or you have to do the VR missions. But at the same time, if you like exploring and taunting like I'm just doing, um, Jetstream Stam is a cool character for that. Power type, uh, his defense is kind of weak, but still, as soon as you learn and you get into the gameplay or get into his gameplay, things are pretty much um, chill. I don't have much, uh, I don't have much uh, comments to say about his gameplay. Right now, I'm just trying to find as many items as I can. That, and don't forget to set up your defensive repairing nanotechs. You always want to keep everything on hand. Let's see, red phosphorus. And no, he doesn't have any other side weapon. He only has his blade, his legendary red salsa blade. Frankly, I kind of just want to find each and every weapon I have here, or each and every items, recovery items or extra health items, mostly because uh, this is going to save us some time, you know, it won't force me to do the VR missions. VR missions are okay, they're just okay. I still find that a bit cheap to have. Ooh, that was nice. Gotta get rid of that one first. Oh wow, nice hit. You see, he has this cool recovery. Cause he can just grapple onto walls. But defensive wise, it's, a, it's much tougher uh, to work with this guy. I guess a strategy would have been just to taunt all the enemies and make them lose their cool. Um, something I'll have to do much more often. I do love the fact that... Oh, let's see. Talks about the VR mission. But I do like the fact that I can basically air dash out of the way. Um, actually evade. But parrying is a bit... Seems his timing is a bit different than Raiden. Or it's just getting used to the new character feeling. I don't know. Uh, here's an example of the VR mission. Basically, mess up all enemies. Shit. This is a bit difficult. At least he can air that. Oh wow, missiles. <sighs> Mid air attacks. This is very fucking difficult. To deal with. Just need to remember his counter. Whoa. Ah, 
I need to remember his dodge. Basically, his gameplay is a bit slower than Raiden, but he, he does have his advantage. I mean, I can't just charge Chu with pure power, kind of like what I used to do with Raiden. Too bad. It's much more methodical. Oh, I can't just get that. Whoa. Getting attacked from the back is also a big pain. At least Taking down target number one is good. Oh, come on. Oh, he still got me. Personally, I don't like him. <laughs> I don't like him compared to Raiden. It's a whole other set of um, timing. Timing that I guess you might as well acquire through those VR missions. Just try to grapple all enemies at once. See how many you can get in one swing, I guess. Ah, oh, come on. And that poor soldier. Bobbing and weaving. Ugh. Oh, come on, still end frame. Come on, get that fluid. Now, the huge issue here is going to be fighting. Fighting those two. Come on, I can't air dodge, I forgot. And of course, the parry is not the same. And, of course, his dodge is not as good as Raiden. Okay. Jetstream Sam gameplay fail on camera. I officially say it. I dislike him compared to Raiden. I just don't like his options. Um, he just doesn't feel as fluid as Raiden. See, I don't have that many options compared to Raiden. It's really too bad. I'll well get both of those spines.
come on. Just before that Metal Gear attacks me. Thank you. Camera's a bit wonky. I gotta admit, they were trying to integrate some of Raiden's uh, motions. Oh, come on. And of course, getting circled here means death. Now, my, my question here is from all those hits, you'd think the You'd think they'd be dead or staggered. Oh, not this time. Thank you for that fluid. It's such a struggle to deal with these things with Jetstream Sam. I don't understand. Did they have a version 2.0? Come on. Oh, I can't even combo cancel my own move. Why are you attacking me? Why are you still attacking me? <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> now the camera's not even on my side. <laughs> oh, fuck this. Oh, man. So, he's slower than Raiden, that's all I can really add to that. He's slower than Raiden, he doesn't have as many invincibility frames, he mostly powers on true. And for that, you get this. You get extra HP. Um, so, all that, <laughs> all that for that 10% boost. And imagine that, you may get like 2 or 3 more of those. Uh, oh crap, and here's another pit hole, or pitfall if you want to say, this is another pitfall, if you're new to Sam's gameplay, which is relatively what's happening here, because I was so used to writing, this is pitfall number two. Maybe he should back up his hard drive. But this is where you get to face 
uh, your first boss as Sam. And of course, of course, when you try to parry with Sam, it's a real piece of shit. And the camera is not on your side. Oh man, the parry is fucking disgusting. Oh, I just can't seem to parry. want to try to get him with your dash attack because at the same time that'll stun him and there you can start wailing on the guy Ah, oh, still caught me on the reverse. There you go. Ah, oh, still got me there. Nice. Right now, I'm just freaking out with the dodge button. I'm playing this as if I was playing Bayonetta. Oh, he still caught me on that one. I get you cut you t I get to cut you into 10 million fucking pieces but my only possible advice for this fight is dodge like crazy play as if you were playing bayonetta and make your controller freak out you fight because you're forced to I fight because I choose to Now, I am quite good, you know. Oh, maybe you should have backed up your hard drive. I know, I don't even know how to crack jokes now. This game, <laughs> this game is just putting me on edge. And uh, that's being all serious now. At least you do get a health buff from that fight but um yeah my only advice would be just dodge dash attack because your dash attack are homing and then whenever he attacks just dodge because the camera is clearly against you in that fight and it's quite a shame oh wow spotted are you gonna come and get me from this point I want to see if he has stealth kills. I highly doubt Sam does, but it's an experiment. And besides, I get to walk in style. Oh, no, no, no stealth kills. Psycho Crusher. Ah, oh, flame chore. Oh, both sides. Wow. 
That is an inconvenient camera space. <laughs> you guys have to agree. This is one messed up camera space. I cannot parry. I can't parry a fucking flamethrower. Oh uh, god. I just want to get that fluid. I think the biggest trick here would just be use and abuse of those dash attacks. How is he flamethrowing me on that one? Ah, oh, fuck it. Doesn't matter. Just cutting the pieces. And take the salsa. I do like his Shoryuken move. Just raises people in the air. I should try and use his alternate moves more often, but I just don't seem to find the use for some of these moves. The charge up, okay, I can charge up with more power to my hit. But at the same time, while I'm charging up, I can always get hit, uh, canceling my charge up move. Unless I just let go. And that's one thing I'll have to investigate. Do I get invincibility frame from letting go a charge up move? If I do, you know, I might as well use an abuse of that. And more health. Oh no, wait, more fuel cells. I take that back. Need that fuel. So, uh, that's one thing. Just discovering Sam. Pretty sure you're gonna get a fuck ton of comments on this. You know what? Speaking about comments. Hey, wait. I want to see something. Uh, he doesn't even have codec. Sam's doing this shit alone. Alright. I'll see you guys in a moment. Hopefully with better performance. 